Allah, the great misleader by Sam Shamoon. Many people do not realize that the Quran not only describes Allah as the best of all deceivers, but it also depicts him as a misleader who causes people to be deceived and misled from the path of salvation. Many are also unaware of the fact that two of the 99 names of Allah happen to Al-Hadi, the guide, i.e., the one who guides, and Al-Mudil, the misguider misleader, e.i.g., the one who misleads and causes to go astray. The Muslim scripture contains passage after passage stating that it is Allah who makes people go astray, since he is free to mislead and disgrace whomever he so desires. Say, O Muhammad, O Allah, possessor of the kingdom, you give the kingdom to whom you will, and you take the kingdom from whom you will, and you endue with honor whom you will, and you humiliate whom you will. In your hand is the good. Verily, you are able to do all things. S. 326. Hilali Khan. Then what is the matter with you that you are divided into two parties about the hypocrites? Allah has cast them back, to disbelief, because of what they have earned. Do you want to guide him whom Allah has made to go astray? And he whom Allah has made to go astray, you will never find for him any way of guidance. S. 488. Hilali Khan. And we sent not a messenger except with the language of his people, in order that he might make the message clear for them. Then Allah misleads whom he wills, and guides whom he wills. And he is the Almighty, the All-Wise. S. 14 Ma 4. And he whom Allah guides, he is led aright. But he whom he sends astray for such you will find no awliya, helpers and protectors etc. Besides him, and we shall gather them together on the day of resurrection. On their faces blind, dumb, and deaf, their abode will be hell. Whenever it abates, we shall increase for them the fierceness of the fire. S. 1797, Hilal Li Khan. Thus Allah leads astray whom He wills and guides whom He wills, and none can know the hosts of your Lord but He. And this, hell, is nothing else than a warning reminder to mankind. S. 7431. The Quran further says that there is no guide for the one whom Allah has misled. A day when ye will turn to flee, having no preserver from Allah. And he whom Allah sendeth astray, for him there is no guide. And verily, Joseph brought you of old clear proofs, yet ye ceased not to be in doubt concerning what he brought you till, when he died, ye said, Allah will not send any messenger after him. Thus Allah deceiveth him, who is a prodigal, a doubter. S. 40, 33, 34. Pickthal. It is ironic that Allah is described as doing the very thing which Satan is said to do, namely, mislead people from the path. Hast thou not regarded those who assert that they believe in what has been sent down to thee and what was sent down before thee, desiring to take their disputes to idols, yet they have been commanded to disbelieve in them? But Satan desires to lead them astray into far error. S460 Arbury. And he entered the city at a time of unawareness of its people, and he found there two men fighting, one of his party, his religion, from the children of Israel, and the other, of his foes. The man of his own party asked him for help against his foe, so Musa, Moses, struck him with his fist, and killed him. He said, This is of Shaitan's, Satan doing. Verily, he is a plain misleading enemy. Surah 28-15